bam, take six. So welcome back to the channel, guys. Uh, and before we get into today's video, I wanna give a couple little disclaimers. Um, the cars you're about to see are not mine. They don't belong to me, I don't own them. This place is not far from where I live. It's about 20, 25 minutes from where I live. And I was going by there today and I thought, well, I'll just stop and make a cool video and I'll upload it so that way if someone sees a car that you're interested in, maybe I'll connect a car to a car person. So if you happen to see a car that you're interested in, I'm gonna put the information down below and then you can just reach out to them directly. I don't have to have anything to do with it because like I said, I don't work for them. I'm not affiliated, I'm not getting any referrals. This is just a cool video that I wanted to do. So stick around, there's a lot of cool cars. And if you're like me, I have a huge appreciation uh, for all cars, whether it be late models, modern, older cars, classic cars, even JDMs, imports, domestic, whatever it is, I appreciate all cars. So there's a lot of cool cars in here. So stick around and let's get into it. this old Ford. It's an older Ford F100. Looks like it might be a 68, 69 maybe. It's hard to really read the tag. It is an F100. An old three on the tree, looky there. Door shut real good. Somebody's welded in a steel bed. I like the old Fords, the old Chevys. You gotta appreciate the old trucks. There's an old Chevy. Looks like it might be an old 66 or 67. That old style stuff. Oh, that door won't open. Maybe you can see in there, you can kind of see. Shavy here, step side, very cool truck. <clears throat> you like trucks, and that's your thing. And of course, you got a little Ford F 250 here, Ford F 250 record. He's kind of done it, made it look like a, <laughs> a character, character truck. Truck here. He's got some more old trucks up here. If you like trucks, I'm not sure what that was. I heard something. Just an old record. It's pretty cool. There's another old Chevrolet here. The old 3100. Very cool old pickup. Needs restoration, but it's pretty straight. The fenders aren't all banged up. It's got a few dents and whatnot in it. And then the old Dodge. Check out the old Dodge. Very cool old truck. I love old trucks. This one looks like an automatic. This one looks like it could be a 63 maybe. Let's see if we can open it. The tag's been painted, you can't hardly see it. Very neat. But it's got a later model seat in it. That's not the seat that came in it, obviously. Pretty neat old truck. And then if those are your things, it's got a little panel here too. The panel's pretty cool. Like little panel. Old panel wagon, 59. 59 Chevy panel truck. Title, yes. Motor, yes. Trans, yes. Fender, yes. Well, that's good. It's all there. Very cool old panel. These things make really cool rusted mods. Looks like it was someone's old hunting rig, mud truck, water truck, whatever. It's got the snorkels on it, you can see. 
really old Wonder Dodge. Wonder Lodge, sorry, excuse me. Wonder Lodge. Read that wrong. My Bluebird. And then if you like the old Bel Airs, here's your one right here. I'm going for Galaxy 500. I like this thing. This is really Galaxy 500s. I like the Fords. I like the body styles of the old 500s. They're very sleek. They're very low. They're very sleek. An old caddy. This is an old Chevrolet. At least it has a Chevy emblem on the steering column, at least. Ford tractor. That's pretty cool. Now this thing here is really neat. Is it old international? I don't know. I've never seen one like this before. It's a very unique rig. Very unique. I'm not sure. It's hard to say. It's very cool. Beautiful. All the stuff on the dash here, that's pretty neat. Very cool. <clears> He's <throat> still solid. Very solid truck. Oh, El Camino. Old Chevelle wagon. You don't see any of them very often. But it's got the cancer. It's got the cancer bad. Look at that. Looks like it's a V8 car. Emblems. It's like an old hunting rig. Look at this. Wow. I had not seen this yet. This thing is cool. Unbelievable. Somebody put some modern electric fans in it. This thing is neat. It's got the stack on it. That's pretty cool. Very cool. You're probably not going to be able to see in there very good, but man. Now, this is obviously not factory. It did not come like this. Someone has obviously done this to it, but it's definitely very cool. Someone's obviously put the body and everything down on the frame. Very cool. Just kind of seeing some of the cars that's here. A lot of very cool cars here. That's really neat. Some less impressive vehicles, but this thing over here is really cool. Old Pontiac. Oh, I'm sorry, excuse me, I said I spoke wrong. Buick. Pontiac and Buick, same thing. It's an old Buick Riviera. It's fairly straight for the most part. Chevrolets. <clears throat> Some very cool old cars. Like I said, if you're looking for one, I might put the information down in the link below. Or information below and you can reach out to him. I don't know. I know him because I bought cars from him before, but I'm not affiliated with them. I just thought I would stop here and uh, do a quick video. To show you guys some of the old cars he's got. Store an old male Jeep. Oh, yeah. Well, 
Let's see. There's an old Carvette for sale. If anybody's looking for one. That looks like it's the old 84 model with the crossfire injection. If you know much about the crossfire injection, when it worked really good, it worked flawlessly. And if you had problems with it, you'd probably never get it right. An old Camaro or RS really slow Camaro. So a lot of cool cars here, a lot of cool cars. So that's about it for today, guys. I want to say thanks for sticking around. Uh, like I said, if you see any cars that interest you, um, the information's down below. Just reach out to them directly. Um, I'm sure they could help you out. All of them cars are for sale. Uh, every one of them, is prices are pretty reasonable. So there you go. Uh, and if you haven't already, uh, go ahead and give me a like. Maybe leave me a comment. I appreciate it. And um, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be uploading some more videos later. So thank you, guys. Have a good one.